there. Greetings in Jesus' precious name. Welcome to Jesus Every Day, Light for Your Daily Path. This is episode 697 and our topic, Lord, why can't I serve you? This is part three and our Bible reference for today. It's devotional. It's taken from Ezekiel chapter 22, verse 30. Friends, if you take a close look, a deep look, a reflective look at society today, the rate of crime and immorality is alarmingly high. At least it is higher than it has ever been and it just keeps getting worse. It is as though society has lost its soul in the name of freedom and exchange moral, decent and honest behavior. You know, uh, uh, it seems like darkness and lawlessness is on the rise. Friends, the Bible says in Romans chapter 8 verse 19, for the creation waits in eager expectation for the children of God to be revealed. There is a godly expectation that heaven has over our generation. God is searching for men. God is searching for women. God is searching for boys and girls who will rise to serve God, do his bidding and stand for righteousness and truth. Dear friends, will you be counted among them? Will you be counted? Be someone who God can find worthy of his service. As you serve in God's house, I pray that you will be blessed. As you advance God's purpose, I pray that you will be blessed. As you carry this righteous burden and shine God's light in our generation, I pray that you will be blessed. Here is our task for today. Spend some time dancing and appreciating God for the goodness you've experienced and how far he has brought you this year. Spend some time just appreciating God for his goodness and how far he has brought you. Pay close attention to our wisdom push, today's declaration and our daily Bible reading, the day meditation and the night meditation. The Lord bless you richly in Jesus' precious name. Have a great day, Father. Hi there. The most beautiful and profitable decision a person can make is the decision to allow Jesus lead their lives. This decision is what we make when we open our hearts to Jesus. We don't just give him our lives. We receive his life. Maybe as you hear me right now, you have not made this beautiful decision yet. You haven't said yes to Jesus. Today is an amazing day to do this. You will not regret it. A new chapter will be opened in your life from this decision. Just say these words after me. Dear Father, I come to you today. I recognize you are a good father. Thank you for loving me in spite of everything. Today, I respond to your love. I receive your life. And I ask that you become King and Lord of my heart. From today, I will serve and live for you. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Congratulations, you have made the most important decision of your life. Now, if you need help to grow in your relationship with Jesus, please send an email to the address on the screen, and we will be more than happy to assist you. God bless you. Have a great day, Father.